All right, we got a house with negative slope in the backyard. We do have a lot of drop when we get to the front yard. And we're gonna run our solid four inch armor pipe. We're gonna run it all the way out here, but I'm gonna show you what we gotta do in the backyard to make this work. The guys are hooking up our three inch plus. They're grabbing up all the downspouts. The discharge is going to run right down the side of the house. The guys lay out their job. Professionals. Professionals right here. So what we have is we have high ground in the backyard. And you can see just how high it is back here. When there's a lot of rain, this water runs down from the neighbors. You can just see how high the ground is over here just falls over here to catch water in a situation like this you have to swale you can't just put a French drain in because the water is just going to shoot right on by so what the guys do is they cut out more sod than usual you can see that they cut out several rows of sod now the men softly ditch this out. The swale is so subtle that you can hardly see it. We want people to be able to mow the lawn. We don't want a swale that's gonna be a problem. So they went ahead and just softly swaled this. And now they're digging the trench for the French drain right down the center. In order for us to catch that water and not allow it to come all the way to this back patio, we have to hang water up to hang water up you got to create a low point a soft swell water always finds the low points now another thing that i want to point out everybody wants to know how deep do you start your trench this is a perfect example the guys are not very deep barely deep enough to bury a four inch pipe barely it's got to be no more than 10 inches. That way they can create more slope at the bottom of the trench by getting deeper. Because this is all level going this way. You can see how much area we have. You can really see the elevations. How high it is over here versus down here. But yet look at the front yard how much fall we had in the front yard. Once the water gets here, this real soft swale is going to catch it. Water always finds the low points. You just create a little bit lower elevation. doesn't have to be exaggerated. You don't want to create a maintenance issue where it's hard to mow the grass. But that's just a nice soft swale, just beautifully done. You cut that swale out. You can literally start digging your French drain trench and have someone to shave this down and just ramp this a little bit. That's it, nothing too extreme. We're gonna put a downspout pipe in here too. I'm grabbing up that downspout pipe. Over here, we're doing a French drain. This is always wet right in here. You can see how shallow they are. This is a branch. This branch does not need to be as deep as the trunk line. Then, as you run this branch to the trunk line, you go ahead and you drop it off on a nice slope. You can really see it. I mean, it's textbook what the guys have done. Right here, we're probably 10 inches deep, it's shallow. Then right here, they just slope it right out. We're going against grade, remember that. So again, this branch to the main trunk line, slope it. You can see how deep we are over here. 
guys did a really nice job. All the details, all the details have been met. Nice soft swale. This is how you take care of negative slope. There's a lot of slope going towards this house. When the snow melts and you have like a rain, you have a thaw, rain and snow melting, that's when all these problems get exaggerated. That's when you end up with flooding. But by stopping the water and causing it to do this, we're going to catch up all that bulk water. We're going to catch all that bulk water. The little bit that falls in this green belt, no big deal. The French drain that the men put up and around the perimeter. This is a nice, real nice curtain French drain right here. That's what a curtain French drain looks like. Real nice curtain French drain that goes into the main. All these techniques you develop, you know, through years and years of experience. You just instinctively get on a job like this, you know what to do. Beautiful work by a professional crew. When you want it done right the first time, give French Drayman a call. If you found any of this helpful, Give us a thumbs up, it supports the channel. If you have any comments or questions regarding the system, leave them in the comment section and I'll answer them. I'm your host, Robert Sherwood, and until the next video.